I am a zebra. 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 Elsevier's Year of the Zebra campaign matters to me personally because I feel as though I don't often get the chance to share my story and to raise awareness about EHL. I know that others in the rare disease community feel the same way. I feel seen and it feels great. I love that Elsevier is spending time this year trying to raise awareness of these zebras, these conditions that can often be so hard to diagnose. Even since my own diagnosis just two months ago, I've encountered medical professionals with a huge gap in knowledge, understanding and compassion for the disease that I have and what I need as a patient. This campaign will only improve that and will show people zebras are important and deserve the same level of care as those with more common conditions. We shouldn't have to fight constantly for what we need as those impacted by diseases like HD. My zebra condition is Huntington's disease. Putting a spotlight on these rare diseases hopefully means that when the next patient walks into your office and has some sort of unexplained issue or issues, and let's be honest, probably accompanied with normal lab tests and results, that their physician will remember something they read or something that they heard from the year of the zebra. And when they hear hoofbeats, they'll think zebras. And maybe for that patient, it'll mean being diagnosed in months instead of years. If healthcare professionals had been more understanding and prepared to consider rare diseases when making a diagnosis, I could have been spared some of the horrible myasthenic symptoms that I had to endure when my myasthenia was uncontrolled. My name is Zaina Balani. I live in the UK, and my zebra condition is generalized myasthenia gravis and I have Von Hippel-Lindau disease, also known as VHL. Hypermobile Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome. And schwachmann diamond Syndrome. Idiopathic intracranial hypertension. I know, I know a zebra. zebra. I know a zebra. Elsevier Zebra Campaign ensures that every disease, disorder, symptom, and person matters in this world. For nine years, I scoured the internet and Elsevier journals for more information on my daughter's condition. Every time I asked her hematologist, what should I be looking out for? And he explained, it's hard to pinpoint because we don't know much about this disease. This campaign will help raise awareness and for patients like my daughter. So one day, clinicians and researchers can say they do know about Langerhans cell histocytosis. Retroperitoneal fibrosis. Tetralogy of Fallot. Hypoplastic left heart syndrome. Langerhans cell histocytosis. Canavan disease. Nail patella syndrome. And my zebra has a condition called cloves. I clearly remember the first moment I heard about this zebra initiative. It was like a lifeline for me. What I think it should stress to physicians and nurses, many clinicians, is that we still don't understand much about various diseases that affect people. It's one of the first times I've had the opportunity to do something for Annabelle, be able to share that knowledge and share the ability to explain things. It matters to me personally because for patients and families with rare diseases, it isn't rare for us. It is our everyday reality. I know a zebra. I know a zebra. And the zebra I have in my family is uh, Huntington's disease, which affects my wife and my daughter has also recently tested positive. I think it matters because um, Elsevier is taking the time to to understand the minorities and I think that's a very powerful thing. It is it means a great deal to have Huntington's disease represented as one of the zebras and you do feel represented. So many of my family members, more than half of them, have a nail patella syndrome and went so many years undiagnosed and this is bringing so much light to so many different syndromes. Because I've been affected by a zebra uh, disease. My family's been affected by a zebra disease. My son's group of friends have been affected by a zebra disease. And that's just one zebra disease. And we know how many of them there are. And we have to get the word out because as someone either who has it or a family member who's there supporting those individuals that do have the disease, it's such a scary thing and you're thinking there has to be a way of how we can help. Not having a clinical scientific background, it's very hard for me to comment about what I, f I feel people should know about this rare disease. But one memory I have is of the time I spent with Holly in the hospice as she reached the end of her life and being exposed to the fact that there were so many children with so many different types of cancer battling with these conditions. 
it really opened my eyes to the fact that we think of cancer still to some extent as being an older person's condition something which we experience as we go through life and not something that children suffer for and really that isn't isn't the truth at all I, i've now seen and witnessed that myself elsevier's year of the zebra campaign is important to me because I want to do a better job in educating people about congenital heart defects to ensure we have better outcomes. I've seen some of the challenge and struggle and, and strength that's that's come from my family dealing with a daughter with a, with a challenging rare disease. I've seen them rally and work to build a foundation to help others work with other doctors to help create new therapies to help people live better lives who, who deal with Canavan and live longer lives. If they do that at a small scale with just their passion, I feel there's so much more we can do by bringing greater awareness to zebra diseases around the world because there are so many and so many different families. So it really matters to me and I'm so proud and it really needs to be shouted out to the world to say, how do we help those that have this these very unique zebra diseases. The people who have these zebra conditions, we need support. We need this attention. I hope that Elsevier's Year of the Zebra campaign has helped you and other people understand the impact of rare diseases on people like myself and the wider impact they can have on our day-to-day -day lives and on our families. Thanks for your interest and engagement in helping us achieve a more inclusive and equitable healthcare system for the hundreds of millions of rare disease patients and their loved ones. To learn more, visit www.osmosis.org zebra.